Good morning and welcome back to another DCS Mission Editor tutorial. Today we're going to show you how to record your own audio files so you can insert them into the game. Uh, you'll be able to hear the human speaking instead of AI voices or instead of the text on a screen. What you'll need to do this is a program to record yourself. I use Audacity and uh, it's been a very uh, easy to use program for me. I think it was a free download if I remember. Uh, you'll also need a place to store your voiceover, so I have a folder name just for that. We'll be able to find it from within the game. And finally, a microphone. So let's go ahead and get to it. Alright, so we'll record a simple message first. Good morning, welcome to DCS World. Have a nice flight. Alright, we'll stop that. Let's do a playback. Good morning, welcome to DCS World. Have a nice flight. Now, it might sound loud enough here, but I know in-game uh, you're going to need to boost it a bit. Uh, yesterday in my mission I was using 20 and that actually seemed pretty well. Uh, see, we're also going to want to trim this so it's just not a longer file. I start talking right about there, so I left click there. We'll go edit, clip boundaries and split. Do a left double click and delete that. Same thing this side. Clip boundaries, split, double click and delete. Good morning, welcome to DCS World. Have a nice flight. There we go. That's much better. Go file, export as OGG, and we'll name this one number one in our voiceovers folder. We'll save that and off to the game. All right, we're back here in the mission editor. I placed an F-18 here on the ramp. Engine's running. Let's go ahead and set up our recording. We'll go to triggers, new trigger, and we'll just call this audio one. We'll do a time more then mission start of, uh, well, just do seven seconds. And the action will be a, uh, we'll do sound to coalition in this case. We'll do blue and open the location. You can play it from here. Good morning. Welcome to DCS World. Have a nice flight. Sounds like the right one. And then we'll save the game and do a quick flight. Good morning. Welcome to DCS World. Have a nice flight. All right. Sounds pretty good to me. Let's quit out of this. And let's do something different. Let's record a new one. We're taking fire. Request immediate air support. We're taking fire. Request immediate air support. All right. So we did another recording. Now I also I went online and found a few uh, free little wave clips. Uh, I've got a radio static sound and I've got some gun battle sounds. Um, you can go ahead and overlay these, give it a little bit more realism. Now I'm not an audio mixing expert by any means, so please bear with me. But uh, hopefully this will help you. Uh, let's go ahead and set the audio on my voice again. And we're going to import audio file and we'll use the gun sounds. Alright, here's both of them. We'll trim them up just a little bit. I'm going to clip it a little bit early though. And I think I'm going to clip this one as well. And I know I want to turn this down just a little. There we go. We're taking fire. Request immediate air support. I want to turn this one down just a little more. I think in the cockpit it's going to sound better. We're taking fire. Request immediate air support. All right, let's just see what that sounds like. Let's go ahead and uh, export this. Another uh, OGG. We'll name this one number two. And off to the game again. We're back in the game, and I've got the uh, other F-18. He's actually airborne, and we're going to make another sound. I'm going to select the one we just did, and we're going to clone that. We'll name this one Audio 2. And we'll do a uh, time more than 12, so we'll hear both of them. Sound to Coalition. Let's clone this, and let's also do a uh, Sound to Group. And this one was actually the test plane. We're 
We're taking fire. Request immediate air support. There we go. That one's done. And let's save and fly. Good morning. Welcome to DCS World. Have a nice flight. We're taking fire. Request immediate air support. Ah, sounds like they both work. Sound pretty good. Hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Have fun making your own audio clips. We'll see you next time.